touchdown Singapore. And coincidentally, because I did Mini Alma. Mini Alma. She owns Alior. Yes, activewear. Activewear. So, Karun, Kai, we're going to buy food because we're hungry. Hungry. So, here they are, guys. We're at the Singapore food court. And you need to order from here before you go to your chosen stall. So there's two. Uh huh. Add soup. Next. Next. No add ons. No add ons. Oh my god. <laughs> Check out. Here. You know. $15. <laughs> Come on, no pressure. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my god! All good, all good. Yeah, we can eat now. <laughs> Let's go. Want to do those too? Let's see the echo. So let's go, let's go. Let's go, Brisbane. <laughs> During takeoff and landing, ensure that your tray table is stowed away. Singapore Airlines is so nice. Look at their lavatory. Singapore Airlines was so good. Although I had a very bumpy first two hours of the flight, but overall it was a really good experience. The service is good. The light is not consistent. I'm so sorry about that, guys. Food, still not good, but better. Better than the other airlines. I was very satisfied with Singapore Airlines. The free blanket and the free pillow, though. Go ahead. shower and eat. I'm hungry. So this is my room guys. Hello. Just a glimpse. So there's an espresso machine. Free coffee. Tea. And then there's a microwave. Has utensils. There. 
Oop, it's empty. And then if you want to iron your clothes, it's a safe box. Okay, so I will settle in, settle down, settle in. I have to open my bag. Okay, guys, we're back at the hotel. I forgot to bring my eco bag for the supermarket. So I ended up buying a bag, 15 cents, on top of the grocery items I bought for today from Kohl's so just gonna show you what I bought guys I couldn't like do a full vlog inside the supermarket because I was very conscious I would become too touristy <laughs> people were already looking at the fact that I was carrying a camera and even if I was just shooting a glimpse of stuff, people would look at me. So like, this is awkward. <laughs> I love banana cake and banana muffins. So I bought this. And then barbecue chicken noodle salad. This is what I'll probably have tomorrow at work for lunch. Some coleslaw salad. Tuna pasta. I love pasta, so I bought salad and pasta mostly. Chicken Caesar salad. Some strawberries. Strawberries in the Philippines are so expensive. Mashed potato this time. <laughs> um, so I bought microwavable food because I cannot cook from where I'm staying. So I had to get food that I could, or I can microwave. And then milk, fresh milk, because I like drinking milk before bedtime. And water. Gotta drink my water and some toothpaste because where I'm staying, there's no complimentary toothpaste. I'm still contemplating whether I do sauna first and then dinner, or dinner and then sauna. Okay, let's do sauna and then dinner. <laughs> and of course, you will be with me, guys. Even in Brisbane, sauna at go guys. So this is the sauna room. It's the same in Ayo Ayo. You pour the water there. Let's go. to sink everything in you know that I finally arrived here I'm so scenty <laughs> this is happy happy tears
<laughs> I'm happy. <laughs> Don't get this wrong, I'm happy. <laughs> I am so grateful to my manager who sponsored this trip. I never thought I would be back here. And one of the places I wanted to visit, aside from Sydney, is Brisbane. Gold Coast as well. <laughs> I never thought I would be back here. The last time I went here in Sydney, to be specific, I told myself, I will be back. I will be back. And I manifested it. Here we are, guys. <laughs> and I'm so happy. Thank you to my manager, Graham. I'm not sure if he watches my vlog, but I am from the bottom of my heart. Super duper grateful for this.